guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm playing around with my filming angle for this one because I wanted to finally film how I color code the edges of my bullet journal. So you'll see here that I've already got January all color coded and I wanted to save February to go ahead and show you guys on camera. So let's get started. First, I have my index, so you'll notice that I have a little square that I keep on my index that just reminds me what color I have. So I'm going to go ahead and do February. So nice and simple. The other thing that I do is I write in pencil the Tombow marker that I use. So this is 772, just so that when I go back, I remember which one I actually had. And this one I didn't label because it was just my copper Faber-Castell and it's the only one I have. So that one was pretty, pretty straightforward. The next thing I do is I mark up here. So you'll notice that I have on my index a little in like basically an index of my color code on this page and then I also have on the edges of the actual pages so what I do is the actual color code is two boxes tall so let me go ahead and show you on January here so if you look at this whenever I count it out each of my little like the little stripe that I do is two boxes tall so I actually am just gonna go ahead and kind of look here and I'm just going to freehand roughly two boxes tall for February. And then I flip, oops, so let's see where's February. So February starts here. So I'm going to flip through. So I know I took about 30 pages for February. Now, sometimes I will fill this in or I'll do my edges at the beginning of the month and I'll say, I know I need about 30 pages. Sometimes I do it at the end of the month after I know how much I'm doing it. Right now it's about the middle, so I'm just going to kind of guesstimate how many pages I will actually need. So let's go ahead and oops, check out. So I'm already up to here. So I'm going to say this is for this week, next week, and how many weeks do I have? This is a good question. Oopsie daisy. Come on. Can't get my page open. There we go. So um say one more week two, three. so i will probably have to go in and finish february just because i'm approximating but i at least will know roughly how long it's going to take me so i grab the section of pages that i know i'm going to do for february and i line up whoops just take a little bit here and i know that i did basically these two here which means i'm going to jump down and do the next two so i skipped one so I skipped one, this was January, so February is gonna start here, so I kinda of do a little mark. And then what I do is I fan the pages, which is always a little tricky. So I fan the pages, and I go with the brush side along the edge. So I go one way, and then I fan them, let's see if I can do this, I flip it over, and I fan them on the other side. It, one side never goes very easily like one of them just never fans quite as nicely as I would like it to but that's okay so I just kind of go in and I color on here and then I can close it Oops, let's go ahead and close my book and you can now see that I've got January lined up and February lined up and honestly that is it it is super simple and that's why I had not done a video before now because I just didn't even think about it, but here you go. Um, quick little tutorial on how I color code the edges of the pages in my bullet journal. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.